campers, for this week, for our BU theme, we're focusing on finding flow. Okay, so what is flow? Well, you're in the state of flow when you are doing an activity that so energizes you and that you enjoy so much that time flies by and you could just keep doing it forever. You just love it so, so much. You're just completely absorbed and um, other people might think you're just like, wow, like so excited about it. And sometimes they can't even understand why you're so excited about whatever it is, but it's your special way of finding flow. So each of us is different in the way we find flow. Some people um, do it through music, you know, when they're playing a musical instrument or singing. Um, dancing is also something that often brings people into a state of flow. It can also be writing or some kind of craft. Um, sewing was something that when I was in uh, junior high and high school, I was so absorbed in I could work on a sewing project for the entire weekend. So it really just depends on what you're interested in and what really gets you engaged and excited. The people who are very best at getting into flow are young children. So if you ever observe young children at play, or you can probably think back to when you were little and playing pretend games or building a fort or doing some kind of activity with a friend that you end up doing for hours and hours and the time passes and you're having so much fun that, um, that you're so bummed out when your parents tell you it's time to stop. That's the state of flow. So all of us have experienced it when we were little, when we were young, when we were playing. But oftentimes as we get older, we don't experience it as much because so much more of our life is dictated by things that other people are telling us to do and that maybe don't get us into state, a state of flow. So this summer and this week in particular, I'd love for you to think about when are you in a state of flow this week? What activities do you do that you just feel so engaged and excited and you could keep doing them forever? And what activities have you thought about that could get you into a state of flow that you want to try out? This summer, maybe you have some extra time. Maybe you'll discover something new that you get really engaged in and really enjoy. The reason thinking about being in that state of flow is so important is because when you're in that state of flow, that gives you a great clue as to what puts you into your best self. So a great way to be your best self is finding what puts you in that state of flow. Figure it out this week and let us know what you find is your favorite way to get into flow. Have a great week. Bye.